Well, you guys are probably wondering why I've assembled you here today for Bloons Tower Defense. And no, 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 it's not for your everyday little challenge. We're using the randomizer wheel! How long do I wait before I go grease lightning? <laughs> oh, nope. Uh, <laughs> uh, 1920? Adam, keep that in. <laughs> so first sacrifice, I mean willing participant, Blade, you are going to be... Um, A sacrifice. The monkey ninja, sub! Ninja, ninja. Dude, you got a good one. I like the monkey sub a lot. Steve and Libby! <laughs> yeah, you let got me know. It. Oh, guess you got a good one, dude. You're gonna love it. The mortar monkey. Pfft. All right, Vale! Oh, I'm most jealous of Vale. What did I get? Milk duds. All right, oh, my man, turn. And what do I get? What the heck is milk Buccaneer! duds? Buccaneer! We get to be boat buddies. Durham, there's no space for that. Surely there is. Just look at the map. Don't you see it right there, Steve? I know it's a bit, but what's Milk Duds? <laughs> oh, Spike Factory. <laughs> Forgot Spike we never factory. told you. <laughs> I forgot. Oh, man, I just been I am you. Jealous of that. Right. <laughs> can I put one in the river at all? Yes, or? you can. I, I left you a bit of. Okay, well, you just messed up all that space then. All right. Well, that way we can fit another one. And another one. And another one. Uh, Blade, I know for a fact you can fit a monkey sub down here near me. I mean, I can fit another one in between Jerome and I as well, so... So which way do I want to go? Should I get one to go trade Empire and then one that goes Pirate Lord? Or no? I mean, I like Pirate Lord. Uh, personal opinion, which you're all going to judge. I'm going to judge you so heavily right trade now. Trade Empire, favorite trade and all that is not really worth it if you can't get a good number of them down. No, I, I second that. That's fair. I no, really fair, don't think fair. it's not going to... You've yeah, said a lot more controversial things before, Blade. That's, that's I mean, it was on this exact map where you put the spike factory in the worst spot ever. <laughs> v vale proceeds to put it at the beginning, <laughs> at the beginning of the track. Is that a challenge, sir? <laughs> vale puts it in a place that literally doesn't reach any tracks. It just sits there. <laughs> oh, man. But we want it at the end, obviously. <laughs> yes, yes. I, I agree. <laughs> Blade's gonna say otherwise. See, look, I you mean, said obviously in there, but Blade will disagree with you. <laughs> I love how you guys paused just long enough for me to doubt myself. <laughs> <laughs> so Blade, it depends on what you call the end. Like there is not worth it. But what do you mean? Um, okay, okay, Blade. How about we talk more about your sub? So are you gonna go the middle? I think the middle route's a really good one. Don't you change one. the subject, Jerome. <laughs> <laughs> This is outrageous. He needs to learn his lesson. <laughs> that boy gonna learn today. I mean, it would be helpful for me with any of my stuff to have things all over the map so that I can constantly hit him with my advanced intel. Okay, well, that's a fair request. So yes. then what we can do then uh, is, Steve, for your next mortar monkey, why not just put it at the beginning? Will do. There we go. And Vale, now if you get another sense. spike factory, then same thing. If you want to put it at the beginning or something, or somewhere no. where we don't have. No, okay, sorry. I'm not sure I can physically do that. It might hurt. I think at one of the bends. Uh, eh. one, one where one don't we have? Okay, never mind then. This is going. I didn't realize right. how much of a how much of a range your buccaneer had. Now the biggest thing we're gonna need is people who can hit uh, camos, which luckily is. Oh wait, actually, all of us have a build. No way. Yeah, I, that's really lucky. That's actually extra that's extraordinarily lucky. Okay, cool. Well, all of us have abilities that can do it. Steve, what's your first thing gonna be? Blue incineration? Uh the reason I would say yes, yes. before you say no yes. is because shattering shells, I have a monkey knowledge point that makes it so it takes off all the DDT special properties. Yeah, that was the plan. Now, normally, Steve, you need all of Blue Incineration to strip DDT camo. But with Shattering Shell's ability, uh, that's the tier 4 one, it moves up to their monkey knowledge. So you basically get to save, like, $20,000 on that particular thing. Yeah, I'm glad you agree. Steve? Uh, with another $300, with the help of my friends, I could, uh... My know, face is bald. Put another one down. Are oh, you okay, here yes. requesting my assistance? Once again, I'm here requesting your assistance. I don't like that my face is bald. Well, why did you make your face bald? Yeah, that's really all on you, yeah, bud. Yeah, you had complete control over that situation. You're implying that I've got steady hands with an electric razor. <laughs> oh, that's a, that, that's a that's a big mood, bro. <laughs> you clearly don't know who I am. Do you know who I am? I know that you're Boris Andrew. I have a I have a KD ratio of 0.2 in most shooter games. I have I'm no hand lie. control. 
<laughs> I generally always figured that you just went somewhere to have it done. Mm. I usually do, uh, but recently I've just ah. been like... What was that? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what was that, like, <laughs> duck noise? <laughs> Steve? Hey, Vale. What Welcome just happened there? Steve? That, that was, was Vale. No, no, that was you, Steve. Steve, that was definitely you. Don't, don't try and throw me <laughs> under the bus, mister. Steve, I will take you down. Steve, what is the duck? <laughs> it's not a duck, it's a llama. What? <laughs> Where did you get a llama? I uh, don't want to talk about it. And is that the noise llamas make? Uh, that's the same question I asked when I got this thing. <laughs> Why? It's a duck. It's a duck. That's a duck. Yeah. So, you guys got any grapes? <laughs> so, Blade, pretty sure you'll be able to hit most of the map here. Uh, you can hit the I'll entire hit. inside. All, all the inside tracks you can. And of the outside tracks, you're only miss- You're missing basically most of the outside tracks. But you can basically yes. hit the beginning and all the inside. Um, yes. Are we gonna have enough position. money for this? I- I mean... Are you launching a nuke? <laughs> yeah, I was wondering what that was too. <laughs> okay, what's so, all the weird noises today? Yeah, what's going on here? Can That's see, not me, I promise. Can I make any weird noises? I can- I can duck again. Uh... Steve, stop your ducks. <laughs> I'm getting all my ducks in a row. So that one camo got pretty far, Steve. and if all of the camos have to get to the end, we're in trouble. Oh, well, I can put down another. Uh, in a I, I didn't buy crow's nest, so yeah, that that was partially on me. I didn't buy crow's nest. Oh yeah, Vail, so you're going permanent spikes, right? Yeah, right at the end, I figured it was the best idea. All right, what is the beeping noise? Is that- Oh, that's, that's Veil. That's my alarm! What? Oh, wait, what? Oh, that was not a meme? <laughs> no, Veil's just like, no. oh, whoops, that's my alarm. <laughs> I thought that was a meme. I was like, what are you no, doing? Like, the power went out last night, apparently, and it just reset it to 12. <laughs> so, Veil, oh, uh, you should put your- Should he put his thing on smart, uh, for Spike Factory? Apparently, or my opinions on Spike Factory don't matter, so. No, it's the placement that it was at. I would the put it on. Placement. So, yes. Vale, you'll have an option for smart spikes. Uh, uh, if you look oh, at like I've already, your. I've already got that. No, 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 but that's actually something you can manually select. So you see where it says normal oh. at the top? Yeah, you could choose. Oh. There it goes, smirt. Smirt. There it is. I'm smirt. And I got a cannon! <laughs> yeah, boy. Yarg! You have a cannon? Yeah! Look at that! Well, I have a ballistic missile. Uh, oh, okay, you win. All right, how many how many pirate ships from the year 1600 would it take to take down a modern day battleship? Zero. Okay. Hmm. You, zero is in. They couldn't do it. I no, mean, I think, that's I think all, that, that's false I think because. Ten. That's false because eventually they would run out of ammo. Now I'm not saying it would be hundreds and hundreds of ships, but eventually there's the, uh, the, the the battleship has to run out of ammo. It doesn't just generate it on board. I think not if you yeah. had I think if you had 200 good pirate ships, you could do it. Okay, I think 200 is a bit overkill even. Well, think about like, I don't know, dude. How many missiles these things have? I mean, not only that, better. but you're you're literally just shooting like giant pieces of lead at it, like. I mean, well, let yeah. me put it this way. This sub's already taken out 2,500 balloons. That is not related at all. <laughs> yeah, <it's> not <laughs> oh, this is Bloons <laughs> Realistic Battle Simulator. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I would say I would say 200's a fair estimate. I really do. Because think about it. The, 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 surely the battleship could also ram an old-fashioned ship with minimal damage, right? Uh, I'm not gonna say no damage, but minimal? Maybe? Yeah. Cause like, if just a few pirate ships rammed a boat, come on. They, okay, they are we, what? Are we talking about like the, the Harrier jet b battleship things, or are we talking about like the sub here? A destroyer. A destroyer. Okay. Like, like a airship carrier. Assuming like that it has no outside vehicles. So we can't be like, oh, well, of course they had 17 helicopters. And like, no. Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, that oh, is part so of the bad. defense of the battleship. Oh, you're going to be difficult. Fine. They have the helicopters. 
Well, it just is. Like, why would it be out there if it had nothing? Maybe it was going on a fishing trip. Blade, why Company do you make fishing everything trip. so difficult? Well, that's okay. like saying, okay, well, the You're pirate literally ships make don't it have cannibal. way too difficult. The destroyer ships have no spike factories on board, though. Oh, oh okay, okay, so... If the battleships have no helicopters and jets that they can't deploy, then the pirate ship has no cannonballs to use. Okay, hear me out. The question that's isn't whether... <laughs> the question isn't whether the destroyer can destroy the pirate ships. Everybody knows that. But could enough pirate ships take down a destroyer? I think no. so. I think so. Well, that would, by saying no, you're implying that a cannonball at full speed, and maybe it can't, I don't know the answer, couldn't puncture a destroyer ship. And actually, no, it's more than that, because keep in mind, eventually if they ran out of ammo, if the pirates boarded, you'd eventually run out of shooting ammo too, and enough pirates with swords could take over a ship. I mean, I know this sounds but ridiculous, you're but... The, you're forgetting the sense of design because of the fact that pirate ships are meant to... Yeah, within their design and the way that they work, they're taking on other pirate ships. Crafts made out of wood. A battleship is much larger. Even to board, it's not even at the same deck level as a regular pirate ship would be. So they'd have to go much higher up, which is going to be harder on them. Sure, but they could. Okay, but what Meanwhile, if they have everybody hooks? on the battleship is just standing there waiting for that to happen and not using their automatic machine And guns. when they run out of ammo once again. Like I said, I would say it was an easy feat, but the, the answer is definitely not impossible. That's not the answer. Yeah. How would... <laughs> I agree. It is not impossible. Like, 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 it could be a preposterous amount. It could be a thousand, yeah. but eventually they will run out of bullets. They will run out of ammo. Okay, let's settle all I'm this saying once is, and for all. All I'm saying is if you, I would pick a thousand pirate ships over a destroyer in a battle. <laughs> okay, so I'll go in on 500 pirate ships, and Jerome will go in on 500 pirate ships, and Blade will go in on a destroyer, and we'll just settle this like men. I like this because I'm not involved. <laughs> I, I wouldn't be shocked either if a cannonball at full speed, if close enough, could puncture the, the, the wall of a destroyer. I would I wouldn't be I'd be actually I wouldn't be surprised either way. I wouldn't be surprised if it couldn't because of just modern day metals and how strong they are. And I also wouldn't be surprised if it could either. Because those things went fast. See, but you're not factoring in for the fact that like Okay, yeah, maybe one cannonball doesn't puncture it. But what happens when you continuously hit the same spot over and over again? Like yeah, Also let's bound, think about with enough shots you're bound to hit the same spot more than one. Yeah, and let's think about how much more people it takes to man a destroyer as compared to a pirate ship. Like, so first of all, they're going to have to... I, I think the pirate ships are going to be way more maneuverable than a destroyer. Yeah, yeah, fair. Blade has just stopped responding to She's us. She's not liking this one bit. Because <laughs> it's a 3v1 argument. Yeah, oh, yeah. I... Yeah. There's not much point when nobody else wants to listen, so. I well, because you're not limiting yourself fairly. You're giving yourself infinite ammo. Like with God Mode hack, sure, the destroyer ammo, could last but also, forever. But also additional vehicles that are on top of the... Like, we even gave him that. We gave him that. I'm not giving him hacks, like, though. Okay, he can have the helicopters, but no hacks. Let me get this straight. The the cannonballs are considered the same as the vehicles, but your ship can have missiles. I mean, that just comes with the time of the age of the battleship. It's not, it's not a difference of, like, it's unfair. I mean, you're talking about, like, diff wrong numbers here, but say the 1500s taking on the year 2000. Like, yeah, they got better weapons. <laughs> of course. But eventually, they would lose if there was enough. A thousand pirate ships going to battle. <laughs> then why in that time frame that it takes for those thousand battle the pirate ships does not another battleship? Because that's not the because scenario. The Why the is there only one battleship in the entire world? That's just the that's question. Not the dis that's not the scenario. <laughs> Literally, the question is, can X amount of pirate ships beat one? Not many, one. And not can, we're past that. How many ba pirate ships would it take to destroy a battleship? Zero. But... But false. All right, you buy the thousand, uh, thousand uh, 
pirate ships. I'll go get the battleship. I've got a cheaper alternative. Why not just get the same grade metal that they use on the battleships? And fire cannonballs. So, so far, things are looking all good. I think, Vale, you're going to be trying to save up for permanent spikes here, right? Yeah, buddy. And, Steve, you got to be closing in on shatter. Oh, man, you were like a few hundred dollars away from shattering shells. That's also oh, good. Oh, yeah, buddy. Now, is it better for me to just shell my money off to Vale to get his permanent spikes? Or should I get my pirate lord? I'd say get your pirate shells, lord. Probably. Pirate lord? Okay. Oh, I'll do that then. <clears throat> and smattering shells. Look at him go. Yeah, I'm shattering everything, aren't I? Oh, to be fair, Vale, it takes a total of 10 rounds to maximize the number of permanent spikes. So we'd want that up by round 80, the latest. And you might not get that on your own. That's fair. It's a tough so call, I'm, but... So I'm once again, I'm here asking for your assistance. Yeah, I'll... There's I'll, no way he'll make it there alone. Yeah, I'll help him out then to get to there by round 80. Because that way, by round 90's time, he'll have accumulated all the ones that he should. For a preemptive strike, I'm going to need another 27,000 myself, too. Okay. So. Yeah, we... Mm, those are both excellent, too. Steve, I think we stop getting stuff for ourselves and just start shelling them off to the boys. Oh, I agree. We and are I think boys. focusing all four of us on one is going to be the better bet than letting one then person. I, I would say first strike mm -hmm. capability for Blade. That's mm -hmm. why I, ga I just gave him all my money. Well, I think I we have just first strike now. I just need preemptive. So. Yeah. So he just I think needs. We buckle down and get one and then start working on the other yeah yeah we could do it we could definitely do this that is for sharks a dolphin itly dog no but actually no, we so. definitely we definitely could do this guys we're gonna beat the randomizer challenge we're gonna get to round 100. it's been so long since we've done a randomizer it really has yeah. it's been well over a month I would, hmm. if i had to guess Swoop. if you had to guess but if you weren't guessing what would you say if I wasn't guessing, then I would probably say... No, 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 not probably, definitely. I would There's definitely no say it's been... It's been less than four years, that's for sure. But it's been okay, a long okay. time. So, less than four years, more than two days. Yeah, somewhere in between that time frame. Okay, as long as we're all on the same page and there's no guessing involved, then I'm cool with that. <laughs> yep, no guessing here at all. This is all it's legitimate reasonable. math. Oh, man. It's reasonable. You're going to get to first strike capability for sharks. I think by the end of it, we'll be able to get permanent spikes and first strike, but it's going to be a close one. <sighs> Say the 7,000 more. <sighs> oh, man. They were they were puncturing through there quite a bit. Uh oh. Wow, 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 Maybe we messed up in not getting permanent spikes first. Oh. Okay. Uh, can we can we do a test subject here? Can we pretend we didn't buy you first strike capability? Can you sell your sub and get permanent spikes for Vale? I just want to test subject it. Just want to see what would happen. I mean, I had like twenty thousand that I could give to Vale. Oh, you already. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think he's upgraded yet. Okay. Well, yeah. Then if you could have just given that money to Vale, I'm just curious. And then I'm gonna just dump my money off to the side here. So everyone, dump the extra money you have, because I wanna, I, I, I wanna do yeah. this legit. But what I, I have on me right now was the extra from the continue. Okay. And I'm just gonna waste away like. There we go. You're still gonna need 500. That's pretty much exactly what I have. So here you go, 585. Okay, permanent spikes. All right, now let's see what would happen if we had actually used our money wisely there. And not that we didn't use it wisely, but maybe just a different way. Maybe we just did it wrong. Maybe we should have done it this way. No, nope. it wouldn't have made a difference. There That's... is one other thing we could have done. Okay, let's, let's see it. Well, I don't know if it matters now, because if I had used that 20 grand plus another 1,000, I could get sub commander, which increases the pierce damage of my other sub. Uh, but what about for 4,000, the artillery battery? The other option too. So there, mm -hmm. let's delete our money here. There was one other option too that we can we could have gone with. Spike storm? Yes. That's exactly oh. what I'm thinking. So we could have gone with spike storm. 
Um, also, guys, you realize you can just do a, a spike factory off the track, right? That's what I'm doing the top left. <laughs> I was wondering where that spike factory came from. Yeah, I just leave them there. That way I don't have to delete them and just keep deleting them and keep deleting them and keep deleting them. Fair. All okay. right. So, if I was... I could sell my pirate buccaneer for $4,600 to get Bale's spike storm. Um, Even then, there's a cooldown, though. But to be... F I don't know, honestly. I think that might have actually just been it. <laughs> what about artillery battery? How much is that? Because that's an 4, awesome. 4,000. 4, yeah, put that towards the front. And then I just yeah, sold I my Buccaneer, and I can give you the money you need for that. So here's their money, Steve. Aim that towards the front, and let's see if this would have made a difference. All right, I'm all good to go. All right, here we go. No, uh, keep moving it. Just keep moving it. Keep moving it, Steve. There you go. Just keep following the track with it. Just keep moving it. Keep moving it. Moving and grooving and moving and moving. I'm still moving. And that worked. All right, there we go. We're in it. Oh my goodness. We're in it to win it now. I don't even have a pirate lord anymore. So I guess now we're gonna need that pirate lord though. Or we're gonna need you to get preemptive strike. Or we need the pirate lord. Well, permanent spikes is gonna have a chance to build up now. True. Very true. I mean, so far we're surviving out here. Does anyone have anything that they could think of to get Blade to his preemptive strike? I uh, say so I sold my other sub, so. I'm actually really proud of us, by the way, for working through that. I feel like most of the time we would have just given up, but like we actually worked through the problem, and I think it was Steve repositioning his mortars, like he's not doing right now, that I really made the difference. I, no, I've been doing it the whole time. Oh, okay, wow. Oh. So it's just bad. Yeah, so. it's it's not a good situation right now. Oh, maybe I should get Spike Storm. <laughs> yeah, I think that might be a very good idea. Captain Oblast him. There you go. Any remaining money? Could you start giving it to Blade, though? Yes, yes, and yes. Let's get yes. that preemptive I will, strike. I, I'm going to need to stop the round because I have to constantly move, maneuver my stuff. True. Okay. True, true. Steve, you're you're Just holding to the team the together like, like glue. <laughs> really? See what I did there? It's I, I love it. Eats glue. It's because he eats glue. Oh, those perfect. There we go, there we go. I'm not going to say it's over yet. I know it seemed like it was, but after we worked through that problem there, I'm not convinced we're dead yet. I mean, I really want Prant to strike, but I also really want the Pirate Lord to come back. Because <laughs> that's just more damage going out, especially because it's splashed out. Well, I, I can bring him back. Should I do a new one where the other one was, or should I put this? Uh, should I use the one I already have down? Uh, I mean, the one you had down was fine. The one I have down is fine. Okay. Well, it's gonna cost me a little bit of money, but he'll get there. I'm gonna need like three-ish grand, but I can probably okay. just get there on my. There Thank you go. You. Thank it's you, kind sir. All right, now we are two thousand dollars ish away from Monkey Pirates. Blade, you're gonna have preemptive strike before the DDTs come in hot. Hopefully. Sent you over some money, Jerome. Thank you, buddy. I got <laughs> what I needed. Oh, good, baby good, Steve. Good. You got, you what, got I what I need. <laughs> I mean, this is good. This is there's worse situations to be in. Uh Everybody panic! Panic time! It's over! This is not easy no, no, no. maneuvering your thing every five seconds to hit all the. <laughs> all I know. The I had to do it for a challenge recently, and it's not fun. All right, we got enough permanent ah. spikes built up there. We have enough. Ooh. Nice. Oh, buddy. We're That's surviving. Spicy. We're surviving out here, guys. This is kind of spicy. Oh, guys, we are so close to Blade having it already. It'll make a big difference to the Prianto strike. It, it really there does. I don't know why it exists. It, it's really unfair how it exists, to be honest. Because it literally gives you a Moab Assassin effect whenever a Moab spawns on screen. So then, literally, what is the point of the Moab Assassin bomb tower? <laughs> like... It, it really devalues that one tower. I don't understand why they did it, but... I mean, hey, Well, I now have it, us. so... Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong, it helps us, so... Whatever. Uh, wow. So what do we want next? Because we're saving up a bit of money here now. 
We can uh -oh. get more harpoon guys. For me. I think more harpoon guys may be the day way. But what do you think about is a monkey sub at all worth it or? Uh, I'm gonna start. I don't know that it'll matter, but I'm gonna start getting up to sub commander to uh, power up my other sub. So I can get the big one at 6,800, but I don't know if that's worth it. I don't. Uh, I would probably the, oh, rather the have monkey. the pop and awe actually. Pop and awe. Prestige. Pop it all? Yeah, pop it all is great, but isn't that 25 grand? Yes. I mean, yeah, but... We're at the point in the game where everything's expensive, dude. <laughs> yeah, if you think we have the money for it. I was just gonna get another monkey buccaneer. Be a pirate, Yarg. Yarg. I think the pop it all would be better just because that'll also, like, stun everything in place while doing damage to it. Ha, huh, Campy! Here you go, Steve. So, like, 95 popping on might be very important. Ah, uh, we'll, we'll probably make... You're right. I, di I didn't think we'd get there, but we probably will make that 10 grand he needs in time. I love that shattering shells. Look at it. Just remove the reinforcements from the BFBs there. Nice. That's so epic. Like, that's really good. Um, all right, let's keep it up, guys. We're being smart. We're being smart Bacchus. I'm really proud of us. <laughs> Why, thank it's a you, tough sir. Challenge. This is a toughie. <sighs> no I'm one said. No one said the balloons randomizer challenge was an easy one, Steve. You ever wonder if Jerome actually spins the wheel? I do. There's, you can see it on screen. It's a real thing. Remember when we did <laughs> the one where you like pick the ones we didn't? Like, like yeah, the prank. All happened to get the ones that we didn't like. Yeah, the prank. Yeah. The good old prank. I don't think you actually spun the wheel on that. The prank. Uh oh, I'm trying to make it around. <clears throat> Bring it around town. Nice. They didn't touch your permanent spikes, so that's good. Let them keep adding up. Uh, Steve, there's some more cash for you, buddy. Thanks for the cashola. I'm very, very curious what happens to DDTs. I mean, you have the ability to hit them with shattering shells now, so... Who knows? I mean, it might make them mega easy. Your shattering shells might literally save the day, Steve. Well, it might <clears throat> shatter it. Did you just... No. Oh, Steve! <laughs> Grease ba lightning. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. <laughs> <laughs> Play me out, Steve! Ba -da -da -da, da -da -da -da, <laughs> All right, uh, Steve, you are three thousand dollars away, and we are closing in on the first round of duties. We are closing in on needing that ASAP. I mean, I don't know about needing it for that. I would say ninety-five is where you're going to need it. And even that need might not even be true. We might even be able to beat it with what we have down right now. But it's just why risk it? Yeah, look, dude, your shattering shells just make a joke out of those DDTs. Out of the DDTs. Oops. And even the reinforced DDTs on Wave 99 don't matter because same thing. You're just gonna be able to make a joke out of them. A yoke out of them. A yoke. Captain uh, Blast has sent it over. Uh, uh yeah, you, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, um. Well, what I got it. Do? Wow, Steve, was that you? How did that happen? They no, all just... I, that wasn't me. Mine's on cooldown oh, right Blade, now. Oh, Blade, did you use your first strike? Uh, I have a robot making that go off. Oh, okay. Well, that was just good timing. Then I was freaking out, man. I actually thought we just lost there. I'm freaking out, man. Well, now that we have pop and awe, that hopefully won't be an issue as often. The problem is trying to uh, maneuver this every like couple seconds to make sure that I'm hitting these things, and then also having to keep an eye on the end of the track. I can't see the end of the track, so. I don't <laughs> oh, do we also want me to get more uh, uh, buccaneers? Yeah, I think at this point everything can just go to Jerome. Buccaneers. Yeah. Buccaneers. Good choice for more pirates. Did ye know yeah. that 500 pirates could take out a destroyer? <laughs> no. Yar, I heard that 1,000 pirates could take out the destroyer. Yar, ye may be right. Mm, yar, ye matey may be right. Alright, I have two pirate ships now. Yar. You should have backpedaled when you had the chance. 
<laughs> ye never took your chance to backpedal, and now ye pay the price. Oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Please Dave. tell me. I was going to say, please tell me someone's got some ability somewhere for that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. I Ho knew that was going to be a good ability to get. Hopefully we can save up our abilities now um, and use them on the big kahuna 95. <laughs> Big kahuna. The big kahuna, Steve. It's the bahuna. The bahuna? You mean it? Bahuna. The one and only the bahuna? The bahuna bahada? <laughs> what a wonderful phrase. Watch, 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 not far enough. Vale has so many permanent spikes stored up over there by now. Mm-hmm. All right, here comes the big moment. Although I think the DDTs are a joke. Literally thanks to Steve's shattering shell. I don't really... <laughs> yeah, they're not even... Wow. I don't understand. I just don't understand. Yeah, but everything else is getting pretty Yeah, fun. it's the sheer number of things making it through. That's true. Well, if you keep giving me money, I can keep getting pirates. Why haven't you gotten a... A pirate lord? Five. Oh, I don't know. I would just be getting a lot of pirate ships instead. Oh my gosh. That is so good. I now have four pirate ships. Yeah. I'll save up for a pirate lord, though, Blade, if that'll make you feel I happy. I mean, that... There's only four rounds left. All right, all right, I'll get one. It might help us on wave 98 and 99, you never know. <sighs> you never know, Blade. Plus, I always wondered about that. My logic behind it is an or. Blade, there was some logic behind it, I do promise. It's because it's $17,000 for it, but for the equivalent price, I could just get three more Buccaneers that have their abilities. So wouldn't that be better? That's what that was my line of thinking with it. I could be I could be wrong. I'm not. This isn't a loaded question. I just always assumed that that. I mean, in essence, yes. Uh -oh. As far as the amount of number of uh, Moabs that you're grabbing, sure. But if you read, Pyro Lord also plunders even more cash from them. Ah, uh, see, I didn't. Remember my shattering that part. shells does not affect that guy. We'll get him. That's strange. Why would it not? If we had a pirate lord, then someone could eat him. Well, it just disappeared right there, so I don't think that's a problem. <laughs> well, I'll have enough money soon. Oh, I just gave Cat Blast him. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, Rick. Ooh, Go, Steve! Rick! Seems a bit early, but... I mean, everything had already spawned. Ooh-wee, Steve. That was a scary one, all right. That was a scary one, all right. Ooh-wee, I'm going to the plank. Anyone got, like, 500 books? Thank you. I got, yeah. I got 500. And now, the, so the pirate lord will be able to hook the... He does hook the zombs. That's awesome. And he plunders extra cash from it. That's super duper awesome. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this cash, but thank you. I can give well, it to Vale to start getting it. spiked Sooner. mines. Let's start giving Vale money for spiked mines. Ooh. There you go, Vale. More money. Steve, if you give me your money, you'll get spiked mines. Uh, I can't right now. <laughs> uh, the... Activate! Yes, let's go! Yes, oh, there we go! Uh, Blade, I gave you my There money. we go. And now it's time I got him. Blast him. for the big kahuna. Any abilities yeah. ye got, ye should use. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> I was just like, I was like, uh, I'm gonna need to use this ability, and I don't want to be the reason why we lose. Including the backpedal. Yes, including the backpedal. Gobble, gobble. <laughs> I had I, I it's not my fault fail. <laughs> gobble gobble. <laughs> gobble 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 g